Has Sony altered now the future of church live streaming with these new cameras? Because these have basically gone under the radar. I feel like no one's talked about them, but we should be talking about these cameras. And if you haven't heard about these, this is the new Sony FR7 cinema camera. So this is in their cinema camera line, but the body is basically a PTZ camera. So this means that you get all the benefits of shooting with a Sony cinema camera like the Picture Profiles S-Log3 and S-Cinetone, 4K resolution, 10-bit 422 color, and the ability to have interchangeable lenses with Sony's E-mount system. And all of this is put into a PTZ body for you to use as a normal PTZ camera. The type of features and the image quality in this camera is just unheard of when it comes to the PTZ world. That's partly why I've never really been a fan of PTZ cameras, because you give up things like image quality uh, in exchange for ease of use. But with this new Sony cinema camera line, you literally get the best of both worlds. You have all of the functionality of a PTZ camera with the image quality of a legit cinema camera. And as you would expect, this is not going to be a cheap camera. It's going to be $10,000 for just the body only, not including any lenses. So it's definitely not something that every church is gonna go run out and buy now once it hits the shelves. But I think this is a really interesting step forward when it comes to live production cameras, broadcast cameras, uh, things of that nature, because this is gonna open up a whole new world of possibility. And it's gonna be interesting to see how everyone reacts to this camera and what advancements are gonna be made in the future and maybe what uh, you know, less expensive options are gonna be eventually put out that is more accessible. So what are your thoughts on Sony's new cinema camera line? Let me know in the comments. I'm really curious to hear everyone's thoughts on this. I think this is a really interesting camera and I'm excited to see uh, more stuff like this in the future. So